Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. How are you? How are Hi. you today? Thank you. Excellent. ¿Qué tal de clima? Por llover aquí cerca. Yo creo que good somos... evening. Good evening. Ya estaba algo caliente hoy, ¿verdad? Ajá, aquí son zonas de esta que es un infierno. Sí. Horrible de caliente. Sí, es verdad que es un sonate bastante caliente. Ay, sí. sí. Era como está este puro hoyo. Puro sauna, así con solo lo que uno suda, que galan que adelgazar a uno, pero no. Sí, sí, hasta fuera galán eso. Fuera bonito. Aquí ha estado bastante caliente también. Bastante, bastante. Bien variable, ¿verdad? Porque yo estuve desde viernes allá y me vine el lunes y estaba bien fresquito. Sí, pero hoy no, hoy sí que ha sido San Salvador, ha estado caliente, caliente, caliente. Ay, Todo el día. Para decirle que yo me bañé hace poquito. Sí, igual, yo aquí a cada rato ¿Qué? me meto al baño. Oh, oh, no, no, ya no se aguanta mucho, mucho calor. Y sí, vea qué galán que, que rebajaran. Sí, como sauna. Ya tú me Maybe, maybe. Nos ayudaría si quiero un poquito. Vamos a ver, let's see. Let's, let's go to. Me iba a compartir, iba a ver, no, no. Sí, pero la mía, bueno. Saben mi manía de estar tomando algo cuando estoy. Vamos a subir. ¿Cómo vamos con la plataforma? Good evening. Good evening. Yo no he trabajado, pero ahora primero Dios. Sí, que como enfermera sí se complica, ¿verdad? Pero hoy y mañana. Sí, sí. Me pongo al día. Sí, lo ven es con cortos. Pero ya acuérdense que hoy les toca, aparte de, de, de los ejercicios, les toca el midterm examen. Vamos a ver. Good evening. Ah, hello, good evening. Good evening. Ángel here. Yes, teacher present. Ok. Espérenme que me perdí. Martes. Martes no te cases ni te embarques. Ni se ve. <ríe> ok. Vamos a ver. Aristides. Present. Excelente. Denia. Present teacher. Nice. Oh, mi nombre es así. Gracias. Sí. Hoy sí tengo más gente. Eduardo. Edwin. Present. Excelente, Edwin. Fátima. Fátima. Isabel. Presente, Nice. Luis Mauricio. Luis Mauricio. María. Present teacher. Nice. Marisela. Marisela. Marlene. Present teacher. Maura. Maura. Lidia. Present. Ok. Oscar Alejandro. Oscar Alejandro. 
Ricardo? Present teacher. Teresa? Present teacher. Walter? Present teacher. Yesenia? Yuri? Present teacher. Okay, nice. Yesenia, no here, Yesenia. Oscar. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Present, ya estoy por aquí. Vaya, vamos a ver. Oscar, Maura, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok, perfect, Maura. Eh, Marisela, Luis. Fátima. Eduardo. Ok. Bueno. Let's go to, let's go to the class. Let's see. Okay. Now, estamos a punto de terminar unidad dos, right? Let's make a mini review of uh, yesterday's class. Remember yesterday, we were talking about have to and need to. When do we use have to? Mm -hmm. Cuando es una obligación, obligación, para okay. eso se utiliza have to, ¿verdad? O una responsabilidad que tenga un... Exactly. Exactly. So if you have a responsibility at work that your boss says you have to do this, uh, clean the table, you're a waiter, right? So you say, clean the table. You say you have to clean the table. Responsibility, no way. Okay. And we were saying that both have to and need to express urgency. Yes, they express urgency and they are used when something has to be done. So if something has to be done, we use have to or need to, right? Depending on the situation for that. Okay, remember, need to indicates a need, right? If we have an, if we have a need, we use need to. I need to clean the house, okay? I need to, it is necessary. It is necessary that we use it or that we do it. I need to clean the house. I need to, to do the laundry. I need to take out the trash, right? If there is a necessity, so I have to do it. And the fact that there is, there is a benefit, right? There is a benefit there. So I finish, I clean the house, and I have the benefit of being in a clean house, right? Or I take out the trash, the same. I have the benefit that there are no more flies because the trash is outside, okay? Have to indicates an obligation. There is an obligation. There is a, a requirement by law or an obligation, as uh, Teresa was saying, an obligation at work. So you say, I have to check my email, I have to make reports, I have to check papers. That is part of obligation, right? But talking about the law, I have to pay taxes, yes? I have to... What other responsibilities do you have with the law? For example, cuando hay que ir a, 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 a servir de jurado, right? That's, that's a referendar right. las tarjetas, la tarjeta de circulación, por exactly, ejemplo. Exactly. That is part of an obligation by law, right? So there is no way. Pero es que no quiero, es que mañana. There is a requirement. And if there is an urgency, right? Especially uh, 
that you have to do it on, on the day or on the time of your birthday, right? Okay. Have to means that there is an obligatory or it is obligatory on your part. So you have to do it in a way, right? But need to indicates that there is a free will. So it is urgency, there is an urgency. Mm -hmm. But you decide if you do it in this moment or no. So I need to feel my cat. Oh, I have to feed my cat. There is an obligation with the pet, right? So you can say, I have to feed the cat. But I need to go to the restroom. So I can wait a little bit. There is an urgency, but I can wait if it is necessary. So you have a free will, right? OK, I don't know if you have any question here. We have to and need to. Mm -hmm. Remember, both are to express urgency. Both are to express something that has to be done, right? The only difference is that need to is like, I need to do it. But if the others, I have to do it means somebody else is telling me to do it, right? Like when you say, um, well, the psychologists tell you, don't say I have to check papers. Say I need to check papers, right? <laughs> That's what they tell you. So you don't feel stressed out with all the things that you have to do. Don't say I have to do them. They say I need to do them. But grammatically is I have to because they are obligations, right? Okay, now. Any questions here? Questions? No, yes? No question. <laughs> okay, perfect. Check. Today we are going to talk about have to, have to has to, need to, and oh, have to, has to, don't have to, and doesn't have to. Okay, check when we use have to. <coughs> so you say, I have to, I have to clean the house, right? I have to clean the house. Is it necessary? Yes. Yes? yes. I have to. I have to clean the house. That if you are talking about he or she, you say she has to uh, send emails. Yeah. I'm going to change the folder here. Vale, sí, ya vemos todas las letras. Okay, so you say. I have to, I have to study every day, right? I have to study every day. Is that necessary? Is that an obligation? Mm -hmm. Yes. I have to study every day. I have to, I, it's an obligation, yes. I have to clean the house. She has to send emails. Remember, we use have to or has to in affirmative sentences to express obligation, right? I'm going to express obligation. When something is necessary, you have to do it because 
If you don't do it, nobody else, nobody else will do it for you, right? Okay. And then check. In affirmative, I say I have to, you have to, we have to, they have to, he has to, she has to, and it has to, right? So remember we have used had and has before. That, uh, that with the meaning of yo tengo, right? Pero en este caso es yo tengo que, right? Because that's, that's a, the obligation here. So you say, yo tengo que, yeah? Yo tengo que cepillar mis dientes tres veces al día, right? I have to brush. I have to brush my teeth three times a day. Yes, she has to brush her teeth. She has to brush. Ay, ¿por qué estoy haciendo tan pandas las rayitas? She has to, yeah? She has to brush her teeth three times a day. I have to finish the report by three. I have to finish the report. When? Today, by 3 p.m. He has to check emails in the morning. Remember, we're talking about an obligation. We're talking about something that is necessary. Any question here? Mm -hmm. When we use has to, with he, she, it. He, she, it has to. I, you, we, they have to. Remember, uh, there is a difference, right? Between affirmative and negative. There is a big difference. For example, here, <clears throat> if you say, I have to finish the report, that means there is an obligation on my part. Yes, there is an obligation on my part that I have to finish the report. I, he has to check emails. There is an obligation on his part, right, to check the emails. In the afternoon, mm -mm, in the morning, right? That's the obligation. Now, if we want to use negative, we say, I don't have to. I don't have to. You don't have to. We don't have to. They don't have to. He doesn't have to. She doesn't have to. He doesn't have to. But check one thing. For example, if I say, I have to check emails, I have to finish the report, that is an obligation. But if I say, I don't have to, that is a lack of obligation. So that means no obligation. Yes, no obligation. Check. All the all the, the models, because later on you will see other models, when they are in negative, for example, a can, or if you say can't, that is a prohibition, right? But the case of don't have to, if you use have to is obligation, but don't have to means not obligation. Tell me, do you have to wear a uniform for work? Do you have to wear a uniform? <clears throat> no, I don't have to. No, you don't have to wear a uniform, right? Mm -hmm. I don't have to wear a uniform either. Okay. It's cool. So that means it's not necessary, right? 
it's not necessary for me to wear a uniform to go to work, okay? Do you have to stay up late? Do you have to stay up late at night? Stay up late means quedarse hasta tarde. <coughs> quedarse hasta tarde. Tiene que quedarse hasta tarde. Yes or no? Mm -hmm. Do you have no, to stay up late? I don't have to. No, you don't have to stay up late. Okay. You don't have to stay up late. Okay. Do you have to get up early on Sundays? Do you have to get up early on Sundays? Is it an obligation? Is it necessary for you to get up early on Sundays? Yes or no? No, I don't have to. No, right? You don't have to get up early on Sundays. Only Walter. Walter, do you have to get up early on Sundays? Do you have to get up early on Sundays? Yes or no? Creo que me quedo en directo. Okay, I'm here. <laughs> okay, do you have to get up early on Sundays? Yes, I have to early on Sunday. You have to get up early on Sundays. Okay, check this. Do you have to finish reports by 3 p.m.? Or you have more time to finish reports? Do you have to finish reports? Mm -hmm. Yes, I have, I have to. By 3 p.m.? Yes. <clears throat> okay. Today. Yeah, okay. <laughs> At the end of the month, Angel. At the end of the month, so every day. Yes, the end of the month. Yes. Okay, okay. Do you have to check emails in the morning? Yes. Yes. Do you have to check emails in the morning? Yes. Oh, yes. Have to. Just yes. Have to. You have to check emails. Okay. What else? What else do you have to do? What else do you have to do? <coughs> what else do you have to do? Yeah. I check the platform and I check my emails, but it's my my initiative. Okay. No, no sé cómo decirle, nadie me lo exige. Okay, okay. Pero yo lo hago porque para mí es necesario, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Pero nadie en mi trabajo nadie me lo exige porque casi no se envían correos, sino que se envían otros mensajes, pero yo recibo algunas cosas por correo. Okay, wait, wait. What about the others? Do you do you have to check emails? Is it necessary for you? Yes, I have to check emails. Okay, you have to check emails. What about the others? Yes, I have to check emails in the morning. Okay. Do you have to brush your teeth three times a day? What do you think? Brush your teeth? Yes, we have to. Yes. Yeah. 
We have to. Yes, we have to brush our teeth three times a day. Very good. Okay. Do you have to work on Sundays? No. No, I don't have I to. Don't have no, to. you don't have to work on Sundays. Oh, that's nice. Teresa, tell me, does Aristides have to work on Sundays? Mm. No. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Eh, solamente ha sido. No, mm -hmm. he you can say no, he doesn't. Sunday. He doesn't have to okay. work on Sundays. Okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay. Let's see, Denia, tell me. Does Walter have to work on Sunday? Denia. Hey, hello. Hey, he doesn't have, he doesn't. Walter. Is it the question is, yes, does Walter have to work on Sundays? Uh, he doesn't have to to go. Yes, have to work. yes, yes, yes. Ah, okay. I have to uh, work on some. He have he has he have to work. He has to work on Sunday. Yes, he has to work on Sundays. Thank you, Daniel. Okay, okay mm -hmm. let's see. Angel, do you have to stay up late tonight? I don't understand. Repeat me, please. Do you have to stay up late tonight? Stay up, cuando decimos stay up sí. late means quedarse despierto hasta uh, medianoche, hasta bien noche. No, I don't have to. <clears throat> okay, you don't have to stay up late tonight. Let's see. Vamos a ver quiénes andan por allí que están escondidas. Ah, Judy, Judy, tell me, does Angel have to stay up late tonight? Señorita Judy. Judy, Judy. Se nos ha perdido. Okay, Marlene, tell me, Marlene, does Angel have to stay up late tonight? No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Yes, no, he doesn't have to stay up late tonight. Mm -hmm. No, he doesn't have to stay up late tonight. Okay. Isabel, do you have to wear a uniform to go to work? Do you have to wear a uniform? Isabel? Microphone, Isabel. Mike. Uh, mm, don't Mike. Have, I don't have to uniform. You don't have to? Don't forget the verb. No, don't have. I don't have to. Mm -hmm. I don't have to uniform. I don't have to. Check what I'm pointing here. Where, Isabel? Where? Where? I Where? don't have to. Where? Where the uniform? I don't have to wear a uniform. Yes. I don't have to wear a uniform to go to work. Good. Really good. Oscar? Tell me, Oscar, does Isabel have to wear a uniform to go to work? Mm -hmm. Se nos perdió Oscar. Ahí estaba tomando café, yo lo vi. Ok, Edwin, tell me, does Isabel have to wear a uniform to go to work? No, he doesn't. Ok, no, he doesn't. 
He doesn't. Give me the complete sentence. <clears throat> he doesn't. Edwin? The microphone, the microphone. The mic, mic. He doesn't. No, he doesn't uh, have to wear a uniform to go to work. Mm -hmm. Exactly. He doesn't have to wear a uniform to go to work. Okay. Do you have any questions here in this structure? Questions? No questions. No questions. No questions. Okay. Perfect. Well, I'm going to send you, check, check the exercise that you're going to do together. What you're going to do here is to complete the sentences using. Hmm? Yes, 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 yes. Bad connection, Oscar. But now we can see you. Okay, check. You're going to complete the sentences using have to, has to, don't have to, or doesn't have to. Yep. Have to, has to, don't have to, or doesn't have to. Okay. It, don't worry that sometimes sentences may vary, right? Probably you won't have exactly the same sentence as another partner. So they can be right. But check that the structure is correct. Okay. Who wants to take a picture to share in the WhatsApp? A volunteer. Ready. Mm -hmm. Walter. Hello, teacher. Can you take a picture of the exercise and share it in the WhatsApp? If no, I paste it here in the... In, in. I'm going to paste it in the in the in the chat too. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect. Check if you can see the photo. Well, yes. Yes. Nice, nice. Hello, grabar in the chat, teacher. Yo digo que sí. What do you think? Can you see it? Hello. Ángel, logras ver la picture? Me está, me está cargando ahorita en, en WhatsApp web. Okay. I can see it. Okay, nice. Yo tomé una también, la voy a mandar por cualquier cosa. Vale, yo les acabo de mandar también al, al, al chat de, de Zoom. Así te, tenemos el ejercicio en Zoom y en el WhatsApp, just in case it is necessary. Okay, what you're going to do right now is go to the rooms and complete the sentences. Remember, you have to has to, don't have to, or doesn't have to, to complete it. I'm sorry, I'm stop sharing. Okay. We are 14, 12, 15 with me. Mm -hmm. Oh, perdimos alguien. <clears throat> 
Vaya, tengo, es que cuatro es mucho. Vamos a hacer cinco. Cinco nos da más espacio para participar todos. Ok, any questions? Questions, questions. No questions. Yes, I have one. Tell me. How do, how do we gonna know if it is negative? That's why I told you, don't worry if the answer, if you don't have exactly the same answers as the rest of the group. Just worry that it is grammatically correct. Okay. Porque cada uno va a ubicar según su contexto y lo que conoce, para usted puede ser afirmativo, algo que para otro grupo podría ser negativo. ¿Verdad? Y depende del contexto de cada quien. Ok. Así es que don't worry si, uy, porque es negativo o afirmativo. Ubíquense en el contexto propio suyo. Okay. Si para ustedes les suena mejor afirmativo, pónganlo afirmativo. Si para ustedes les suena mejor en negativo, pónganlo en negativo. Ok. Lo que sí tienen que cuidar es que gramaticalmente esté correcto. Ok. okay. Perfecto. Any other question over there? Any other question? No. No, no. Ok. Bueno, allá vamos. Sí. Todavía veo aquí a Ricardo, a Oscar. Try to join Oscar. Hello. Hi, hi. Fátima. Hello. Fátima. Hello, Mariana. Aquí está Mar. Ricardo, no sé si andará manejando. Voy a, voy a conectarme de la compu porque aquí en el teléfono no mucho. Ok. Vaya. Ya salió Ricardo. Fátima, Fátima, Fátima. Fátima. Está conectando, creo, ahorita. Ay. ¿Son sus compañeros? Me quedé solito. <risa> Por eso le hablé. Fíjense que aquí estaba Yuri. Eh, Ajá. Estaba copiando y me saludó. Cuando yo le iba a saludar, ya no la vi después. Quizás se le fue el inter o algo. Oh. Entonces, por eso le estaba escribiendo porque me quedé solito. Ah, 
¿Será que está lloviendo allá donde está Yuri? Ah, sabe. <risa> Vaya, me lo voy a llevar entonces, Santi. Ok. Por eso le hablé. Está allá, aquí está Yuri. Vamos a ver si se logra. Ah, va. Vamos a ver qué pasa. Ahí está. Ahí está. Hello, Yuri. Hello. <risa> Hola, teacher, no sé qué hola, pasa, hola. esta cosa me saca. ¿Será el Inter o será la, Creo la que aplicación? Inter, la aplicación, no sé, pero el Inter ahorita no me ha estado fallando. Yo creo que es la aplicación. Es la aplicación, la tiene que actualizar. Hay que actualizarla. Pues ya la actualicé, de hecho aquí tengo un mensaje donde dice Zoom se le ha actualizado. Pero no sé por qué me está sacando. Ah, pues por eso le cayó la actualización ahorita que estaba en clase. Ajá, quizás por eso, ¿eh? No me quiere. Zoom no me quiere. <risa> Ay, no. Okay. Vaya, go ahead. You can work together. Ok, thank okay. you, teacher. You're welcome. Yo me quedé. Ve, se volvió a salir, mira. Ah. Sí, le está fallando entonces la aplicación ahí. Sí. Eso Qué me pasa con mis estudiantes. Qué tremendo. A ver, Ricardo. Ahí está. Hello, Ricardo. Hello, hello. Vaya, Ricardo, hoy sí, ¿verdad? Ya casi, solo, solo llego y, y me instalo. Solo parqué el carro. Ya casi. <ríe> Vamos a ver si hoy sí se logra quedar Yuri. Ahí viene otra vez. Sí. En aquí donde por ejemplo hay un nombre Mandy es de es de mujer verdad entonces es sí. she verdad she doesn't 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 What is the meaning of tidy or tidy? Tidy is ordenado. Okay. Ordenar. I have to tidy. Por ejemplo, si usted dice, I have to tidy my room, es que tengo que ordenar. Ordenar. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Tidy. It's wrong. I finish. <laughs> Excellent. Vaya, a ver si no, no logró entrar Yuri. Si, no, si ella no logra actualizar la plataforma de Zoom, no la va a dejar entrar. O tiene que reiniciar todo el teléfono o que, el aparato. Desinstalar, ¿verdad? Y volver a instalar. Sí. Vaya, aquí está Ricardo para que comparen. En la 3. Y de frente es have to get every. Yo tengo que no la contesté. Sí, have, have to. Have. have to get early. Los amigos. Los amigos. Sí, porque si, si, si la responde, tendría que responderla con day, ¿verdad? que son ellos y es rápido uh -huh. creo ah pues yo me equivoco ah 
I don't really think alrededor de sí. Sí, vos le queda cerca. Sí, queda cerca. Y yo que voy hasta el aeropuerto. Voy hasta el aeropuerto. De Comalapa. Sí. Pero no trabaja en el... ¿Cómo se llama? Did you finish? Yes, finish. Yo no yes, todavía. Me faltan dos teachers. Ok. Did you finish here? Finish, finish, Maura. Hi, Judy. Hi, teacher. Me dejaron solita. Mira que, que esa cosa me volvió a sacar. Nomás usted se salió de un solo me sacó. Uh, no, es que yo me salí sacándolos también. Ah, ok. Vienen ya. Vaya, vamos a ver. Let's see, let's see. 27 minutes for everybody to be, be to be here. Ready? Yes. Okay. Perfect. Vaya. Let's see. Let's see. I'm going to share. So we do the exercise together. Let's see. Number one. He has, he has, has to, to work. work. He has to work in the evening. Evening, May. Has. Um, has. Good. He has to work in the evening. Mm -hmm. We we don't have don't to go have to go shopping. Shopping. We don't have to go shopping. It's not mandatory, right? It's not an obligation. Okay, we don't have to go shopping. Number three. Don't have. Don't have. They don't the have friends, to get up. Okay. The, the, friends, the friends. The friends don't have to get up early. Don't have to get up. Okay, don't they really. don't. Don't have to get up early. What about Mandy? Mandy has to, to read the instruction. Mm -hmm. Has to. Has to read the instruction. Yes. Mandy has to read the instructions. Very good. You? You have to finish have that. The project. The project. You have to. You have to finish the project. Number six, we. We don't. We have to get up early on Mondays. Have to get up early on Mondays. Very good. Number seven, Mary. Mary doesn't have to go to school on Saturday. Mm -hmm. Mary doesn't have to. Yes. 
Yes, Mary doesn't have to go to school on Saturdays. What about eight? They? They have to. They don't have to play in the classroom. Mm -hmm. They don't have to play in the classroom. And number nine, John. John have to tidy his bedroom. Yeah, he has to tidy. He has to tidy. Seven kids tidy. Yes. Ordenar, ordenar. Ordenar, exactly. Tiene que ordenar su cuarto, right? John has to tidy his room. Okay. Now repeat. He has to work in the evening. He has to work in the evening. He has to work in the evening. He has, he has to, to work, work in, in the evening. evening. We don't have to go shopping. We don't, we have, don't to have to go, to go shopping. shopping. We don't have to go shopping. We don't we have, have to go, to go shopping. shopping. The friends don't have to get up early. The, the friends, friends don't, don't have, have to get out early. early. Mandy has to read the instructions. <laughs> Mandy, Mandy has, has to read the instructions. instructions. Mandy has to read the instructions. Mandy has, Mandy to, has read to read the, the instructions. Has to read the instructions. You have to finish the project. You have, you have to, to finish the project. the project. We have to get up early on Mondays. 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 Mary doesn't have to go to school on Saturdays. Mary doesn't have to go to school on Saturdays. They don't have to play in the classroom. They don't have to play in the classroom. John has to tidy his bedroom. 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 Okay, one volunteer to read number one. Volunteer? Yes, Walter. He has to work in the evening. Nice. Who reads number two, Walter? We don't have to go shopping. Mm -hmm. Choose another victim. <laughs> and him. Okay. And the number three or yeah. number two? Number three. Three. Their friends don't have to get up early. Mm -hmm. The friends don't have to get up early, great. And number four, Mandy. Denia. Number four, uh, Mandy has to read in the instruction. Yes, Mandy has to read the instructions, great. Who's next, Denia? Uh, Mary. Mary. Maria. ¿Cuál es, teacher? In number five. You have to finish the project. Great. Who's next, Maria? Isabel. Isabel. <clears throat> okay, we had to get up early on Mondays. Mm -hmm. Yes, we have to get up early on Mondays. Yeah. Okay, Isabel, who's next? Judy. Judy. Mary doesn't have to go to a school on Saturday. Exactly. Very good, Judy. Who's the next one, Judy? Okay. And veamos Arishide. Okay. 
Number eight. Yeah. They don't have to play in the classroom. Nice. So let's do this. Who's next one? Edwin. John has to tidy his bedroom. Mm -hmm. John has to tidy his bedroom. Very good. Do you have any questions here? Questions? Teacher, en la, en la primera se, eh, se puede responder negativa porque sure. yes. dice trabajar en la noche, ¿verdad? Ajá, exacto. Sí, claro que sí puede ser negativa. También la number six, we don't have to get up early on Mondays. I don't have to get up early on Mondays. I start work at nine. Right, so I don't have to get up early. Yeah, sure, you can make it negative. You say he doesn't have to work in the evening. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alguien que trabaja en un restaurante podría decir, we we'll have to go shopping. So they can vary. Recuerden, ahí va a ser dependiendo del contexto de cada quien. Right? Podría ser John doesn't have to tidy his room también si tiene alguien más que lo haga por él, right? Podría ser negativo. In my, in my case, mm -hmm. I, I write the second, the second mm -hmm. sentence in affirmative. We have to go shopping. You have to go shopping. Uh -huh. Exactly, sí, no problem. Eh, recuerden lo que les dije al principio. Aquí pueden variar las respuestas. Alguna que alguien haya puesto afirmativa para usted puede ser negativa. Lo único que tienen que ver es que están usando gramaticalmente correcto, right? Porque va a depender del contexto de que según su trabajo, según su trabajo, tiene que responder. ¿Any other question there? Question. Question. Any other question? No. Question. Okay. Bueno, vamos al manual. Check your manual. I tell you the page. Page 25 in your manual. Vamos al reading. There is a reading here. We have a new you have an email. What you're going to do is with the email and organize the activities. Casi no le entiendo, my... teacher. ¿Qué es lo que no entiende a mí? Los vamos a tallar a todos. Ahí está. Okay. What you're going to do is go to page 25 in the manual. Page 25 in the manual. And okay, read the read the email, right? Read the email and organize the activities that Guadalupe needs to do by importance. Yeah. What are the activities that Guadalupe needs to do? Ya hoy estamos metiendo terceras personas, ¿verdad? Entonces aquí ya, yo digo, I need to do, but he needs to do. Check this. Needs. Mm -hmm. I need, he needs. Supongo que Guadalupe es un hombre, pero puede ser mujer. Así es que no hay problema si usted le quiere poner he o she. ¿Ok? No sé por qué a mí se me ocurrió que podía ser hombre, pero también Guadalupe puede ser mujer. Entonces ahí depende. Eh, usted le puede poner she o le puede poner he. No sé. ¿Ok? So, what you're going to do is organize the activities that Guadalupe needs to do, ¿sí? By importance. ¿Cuál actividad es más importante? Entonces, ¿cuál es la que tiene que ser primero? Okay. If you see here, 
Aquí va a ir poniendo las actividades según importance, right? Which is the first, the second, the third, and the fourth, according to the email. Los voy a mandar a los grupos. Acá dicen parejas, pero los voy a mandar en grupo por si alguno se me pierde en el camino. Right? Any question? Question? Las actividades de Guadalupe están desordenadas en sí, teoría. Están en super el... desordenadas. Bueno, Ajá. de hecho, let's read the email, right? It says, Dear mm. Guadalupe. Dear Guadalupe, I, uh, these are some of the tasks for this month. I really need you to contact the first three potential customers in the list from Mr. Sanchez. You have three days to do it, three hours each day. Call the new clients from the last week, uh, from the last three weeks and give them the catalog information for June. You have two days to do it, one hour per day. O sea, solo tiene dos horas para hacerlo, right? It is very important to send the two latest sales reports on May 26th and the write a new welcome letter for the new customers. Aquí creo que sería, and to write, diría yo, ¿verdad? Yeah, it is very important to send the two latest sales reports on, Ma on May 26th and to write a new welcome letter for the new customers. You have one day to do it, four hours. Finally, visit the two stores in Santa Tecla. You have two days to do it, two hours each day. Organize your week. Ahí va a ser cuestión de prioridades. Remember, we said, when we use need to, we're talking about priorities. Y como es need to, no have to, don't worry. You decide on what are your priorities or what are Guadalupe's priorities, right? According to the instructions given by the boss. The thing is that by the end, you should include all the four activities. And I would like to hear each group telling me what you have given, uh, what is the, the order that you in your group have given to the activities, and then you will tell me why. Porque es probable que un grupo tenga prioridades ordenadas de alguna manera y otro grupo las tenga de otra. Ahí va a depender cómo usted se organiza en su trabajo y qué es lo que usted considera que es más prioritario que otro. ¿Ok? Vale. Así es que igual, no se me vayan a asustar de que sus actividades no estén en el mismo orden que las de otro grupo, porque ahí va a depender de usted cómo organiza las actividades, si la base de prioridad por el tiempo, por los días, o cómo. Right? De Yurisai. ¿Estamos? Ok. ¿Are you ready for that? Si quieren. Sí, la, la tenda, teacher. Ay, la tenda, thank you. Si quieren dibujar, eh, ¿verdad? Pueden dibujar el, el ¿cómo se llama? La semana, ¿verdad? Si ustedes quieren. Ahí pueden dibujar así el, el horario de lunes a sábado para que se organicen mejor y vean qué les queda para cada uno de los días. Right? Vamos a ver, Angel. Present. Great. Eh, Aristides. Present. Denia. Present. Eduardo. Edwin. Present. Eh, Fátima. Present teacher. Isabel. Present. Luis Mauricio. 
Luis. María. María. Present teacher. Sí. Maricela. Maricela. Marlene. Present teacher. Maura. Present. Lidia. Lidia. Lidia, Lidia, Lidia. Ahí estaba Nidia, ¿verdad? Oscar. 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 Ricardo. Present. Teresa. Present teacher. Walter. Present teacher. Yesenia. Yuri. Present teacher. Ok, nice. Perfect, perfect. Well, let's go then. Let's continue. I'm going to send you to the rooms, pero okay. vamos a volver a, a programar los rooms para que cambien de compañero. Ok. Let's see. Me quedan dos, dos parejas, tres tríos. Ok. ¿Listos? Yes, yes. yes. Estamos listos. Yes, right? Yes. Ooh. Yes, ok, perfect. Allá vamos. Remember, do the reading and organize the activities according to priorities. Ah, lo que les decía. Si ustedes quieren, pueden ubicar, pueden hacer el, el horario, ¿verdad? De toda la semana, porque solo es una semana la que tiene Guadalupe para organizarse y hacer todas esas actividades. Pueden dibujar el, el horario, ¿verdad? De lunes a sábado. Vamos a ver si tiene sábado para trabajar eh, Guadalupe. Uh -huh. In the first activity, in the first activity, Guadalupe has three days. Three days, three hours each day. Ya tiene nueve horas para esta, right? In the other one, has two days. One hour per day. Porque aquí tiene en total two hours. Y póngale atención también a estas palabras, ¿no? como it's very important. It's very important. Entonces, póngale atención a esas palabras, se lo considera como una primera. Here you have one day. One day, four hours. Aquí, cuatro horas. Just one day. Finally, you have two days. Two hours per day, otras cuatro horas. Ubíquese si gusta en la, en la semana. Pueden hacer su horario. ¿Verdad? Si lo consideran necesario para que vayan de lunes a, a viernes quizás. Me imagino que no trabajan sábado. Entonces, puede ubicarse, pueden ubicarse de lunes, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, y Friday. Para que se ubiquen, ¿cuál es la más urgente? La que va a poner en on Monday, ¿vale? Y aquí vaya viendo que le vayan quedando eh, las horas y los días correcto según las prioridades para que ya de acá ya lo puede llevar para el otro ok así se les facilitaría quizá un poco más ya saber cuántas horas son para cada uno para cada actividad cuántos días cuántas horas 
aquí ya se vienen a ubicarlo en su horario de la ciudad. Y ver cuál es la prioridad de cada uno. ¿Ok? ¿Any question? Ay, no le estoy compartiendo. Eh, espérame, le voy a mostrar el, el horario que he hecho yo. Macheque. Contando días, horas. Pueden ubicarlo así en el, en el horario de la semana. Para que vayan viendo... Pongan la atención a las, a las frases. Like, it is very important. Remember to do it. Yeah. Okay. So, like that, you can organize in the week. Y ya de aquí, ya se lo llevan para el estado que me van a presentar. Okay. Any question? No questions. No. No, no. Va. No question. Ok, perfecto. Allá vamos entonces. There you go. Vamos a ver, Judy, a ver si hoy me la deja unir. Veamos. Sí, no sé. Ahí tendría que estarla hablando ya al room número 3. No le aparece llamada para, para reunión. No, no me aparece nada, Tisha. Vamos a ver, me lo voy a dar, moverla a otro room. Sí, me la, me la muevo. Hoy sí. Hoy sí. Va. Okay. Excelente. But say you have a tree the last three weeks and give them cataloged information for you. You have two days to do it. Uh -huh. Say two days. Eso lo puede hacer el día martes y lunes o martes. You have today. Send catalog. Perdón. No, no, no. Leyendo. All the new clients. It's very important to send the two lastest, lasted sales reports on May 26 and rewrite the new welcome letter for the new customer. You have one day to do it or hours. Finally, visit two store in Santa Tecla. You have two days to do it. Two hours. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Porque ahí tiene un día con cuatro horas. O sea, uh -huh. es, tiene, basa, tiene bastantes horas, sí. pero solo un día. Solo un día, sí. sí. Tiene Entonces, que ser el yo, primero. Sí. Yo le había puesto así, no sé si está buena. She has to send the to send. To last to send. report uh -huh. on May. 26. No sé si así es. And to write, porque hace dos actividades. Tres horas al día tiene para hacerlo. Hola, teacher. Hi, hi. Hello, teacher. Hello. Entonces, entonces sería, esa sería buena. Sí. ¿Verdad? Ajá. Hoy no faltarían los otros días. Sí. En la otra dice: Call the new clients from the last three weeks. And tres semanas. Ese, digamos que tiene más tiempo para hacerlo. 
Ah, no, 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 no. Es de las últimas tres semanas. Llama a los clientes nuevos de las últimas tres semanas y dales la información del catálogo de junio. ¿sí? Junio. Ajá. Y el que está entre paréntesis, ¿qué dices tú? Tienes? Organizar. Organizar, dice. Sería el lunes all the new from the last three weeks. Ajá, de las últimas tres semanas y, y les entrega el, el catálogo de información para junio. Uh -huh. Y tiene, no. dice ahí le da dos. Dos días para hacerlo, una hora cada día. Así es. Pero hay unas más importantes y estas son las que no le estamos poniendo atención. Seis, dos días en la semana, una hora cada día. De ahí dice... Es muy importante enviar los, reportes, los, los últimos reportes. dos reportes de ventas en, de mayo. May, mayo 26. Y escribir el nuevo, ¿qué dice? Bienvenidos. Necesito que contacte a los primeros tres clientes con permiso. Para los nuevos clientes. Para los nuevos clientes. Sí. Tienes un día para hacerlo cuatro horas. Finalmente, visitar las dos tiendas en Santa Tecla, ¿sí es? Sí. The first three potential. The first three potential. Customer in the list from Mr. Sanchez. And the list from Mr. Sanchez. Okay. The four. Santa Tecla. The two stores in Santa Tecla. In Santa Tecla. Uh -huh. And the fourth one, she has to contact the first three potential customers in the list from Mr. Sanchez. Yes. Así los ordenamos. Yes. Uh, teacher, so we can use she for Guadalupe. Yeah, sure. Sure. If even you though think... even though I have an uncle named Guadalupe. Yes, I know. I have a friend called Guadalupe and it's a good one. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah. So yeah, they can they can be different, right? Exactly. It can be for a man and it can be for a woman. Tenemos un Isabel en el grupo. Ajá. Sí, sí, Guadalupe sí. también, Denia Guadalupe. So the, there are names that are for both, right? Eh, Isabel es puede ser usado también por hombres y mujeres porque pues, eh, Isabel es, es hombre. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, yes. Nosotros finished, teacher. You finished. Okay. Yeah. Con la ayuda de Aristides. Excellent. Yes. No, ellos lo hicieron también. Ellos lo hicieron. Okay. Yeah. We're just going to give me one more minute. One okay. minute for the others to finish. And then I call you. Okay. Okay. Y Teresa en el, en el reporte ahí escribiendo rapidísimo. Ella va a compartir la pantalla. Sí, es, que le digo de que, es que le digo que me sale mejor. Sí. Eh, así, sinceramente. Sí. Lo entiendo para estudiarlo mejor también. Sí, yeah, yeah, definitely. Definitely. Okay. No está dando envidia ahí que puede escribir ahí. <risa> No, 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 pues claro, con tanto planning, ¿verdad, Teresa? ¿Cómo no va a aprender a estudiar? Exacto, no en balde saqué el bachillerato en Administración de Empresas y Secretaría Comercial. Secretaría Comercial. Eh, me too. Eh, en, eh, ah, ah, también. Secretaría. Entonces sabe taquigrafía también. Sí, mecanografía. Wow, mecanografía. Taqui. How many years ago, Teresa? Qué malo. Fifty maybe. Fifty maybe. I graduated from high school. Um, I am. I am. I am. I am. I am. I am. I graduated. I graduated. Um, Mil, mil novecientos noventa y tres. Hace poco. Really? <laughs> 1993. Wow. 1993. Ah, pues me ganó. Yo en me... 19... Mm, 19... Mm, 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... 19... The university in in ninety nine. Okay, I was. I graduated, but I didn't graduate until twelve. Twelve. How do you say? Two thousand one. 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 Um, problems uh, assessor the that thesis, thesis mm -hmm. the thesis the thesis uh, the time wow Por eso. <laughs> you know I graduated from high school in 1989 mm -hmm. <laughs> yes 1989 Por eso, that teacher Aristides, my molest. Como es que molest? He's bothering you, yeah. He's bothering you. No. I mean. When, when did you graduate from high school, Aristides? Um, 2008. Okay. Yeah. 2008. I was studying at the university by that time. And in front of the university, 
Uh, can I say 2014? Sure. No. Yes, sure. 2014. 2014. Okay. Perfect. Yes. Ya no le dieron taquita. Ya, vaya. Ya no. Ya no. Me perdí de eso. <laughs> <laughs> Bien chivo. Yes. Remember, los gramálogos, right, Teresa? Yes. Los gramálogos. Por eso le escribiré una layer, layer carta. ¿Cómo se dice? Write him a letter with gramálogos. Gramálogos. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that would be nice. Well, I'm going to call you now. Okay. Okay. Let's see, still some people. Hello, hello. Hello. Ready, ready, right? I think so. Who will be my first group? I want to listen. Then we want to. We want to be the first group. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Quien comparte pantalla? Teresa. Micrófono. Designamos a Teresa. Okay. ¿Cómo hago para compartir pantalla? Se le clic aquí donde está la abajo, la flechita verde que dice compartir pantalla. Y aunque la tenga en la computadora, se puede. Y usted tiene, este, está con el celular y la compra. Sí, estoy con el sí, celular conectado. Ah, haga como hizo cuando estábamos en el grupo chiquito, con el celular puede dirigirse a la pantalla y así nos lo comparte. Um, las oraciones, las sentences, uh -huh. la orden. Yeah. Ok, ahora. A ver si se ve. Ahí está, sí, sí, sí. Ahí, no sé. Chico, lo mueva un poquitito. Ok. Un poquito a la, a la derecha o a la izquierda, vamos a ver. Así, no sé. Uh -huh. Perfect. Ahí está. Yes. Nice. ¿Quién la va de, de cualquiera o de nosotros. Sí, uno de ustedes. Bueno, bueno a cada uno tal vez les parece. Okay. Sí, ¿Qué? está bien. Teresa, lea la primera. Solo una. She has to send that to last cell report on May 26 and to write a new welcome letter for the new customer. Bueno, sigo yo. Eh, she has to call the new clients from the last three weeks and give them a catalog information for June. Okay. Number three, Number what? Three. She has to visit the to, uh, store in the Santa Tecla. Okay. And the last one? Aristides. Okay, okay. She has to contact the first three potential customers in the list from Mr. Sanchez. Okay, perfect. Thank you, thank you. A ver, eh, los demás grupos, ¿cómo están? ¿Tienen el mismo orden o tienen alguna diferencia? Exactly. You have it exactly that way. Yes. yes. Okay. 
Ah, what about the others? ¿Cómo andan por allí? Teacher. Ya, mi deña. Nosotros con Maura las tenemos distintas. Ok, go ahead, chair. Yeah. <clears throat> eh, la primera, she has to visit the two store in Santa Tecla. Ok. Eh, Maura, no sé si usted quiere decir, la, decir otra oración. Maura. Bueno, la voy a decir yo entonces. Okay. Eh, she has to contact the first drill potential customer in the last, in the list from Mr. Sanchez. And number three, he has to write a new welcome letter for the new customer. Number four, she has to send to she has to send the two la last salad lester salad what latest lexus salad report of my 26 y una quinta que pusimos she has to guide them the catalog information for them okay okay excellent no tenemos fecha del documento en que fue escrita, ¿verdad? Ok. No. No tiene, no tiene fecha. Ok. Ajá. Do we have any difference? Somebody else has anything different? Teacher, nosotros con Fátima también las tenemos distintas. Ok, go ahead. La primera, it's very important to send the two latest sales report on May uh, 26. Uh -huh. And to write a new letter for the new customer. Sí. Ok. Yes. La segunda, Visit to visit the two stores in Santa Tecla. You have two days to to do it. Two hours each day. Organize your week. Okay. Ya esta parte la pueden omitir la de donde dice organize your week esa la pueden omitir. Uh -huh. En la tercera. I really need to contact the first three potential customers in the in the list from list? Mr. San in the list from Mr. Sanchez. You have three days to do it, three hours each day. Mm -hmm. And which is number four? Call the new clients from the last three weeks and give them the catalog. Catalog, como se dice catalog? Catalog. Catalog, catalog information, information for June. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Y hicimos otra más. Okay. Eh, the, the write a new welcome letter for the new customers. Okay. Okay, very good. A ver, ¿qué tomaron como parámetro para, para ese, para? Para el orden. Uh -huh. el, en, la, en la primera, por la fecha, porque él dice que es muy importante que envíe correos, eh, perdón, que envíe el, repo, el reporte de ventas de mayo 26. Ajá, ajá. Por, por la fecha, que es más, más antigua que las otras, por eso la tomamos como referencia. Ok. Y las otras nos fuimos guiando más que todo por los días que le dio para, para hacer las actividades. That's a good point. I was thinking, I was thinking about that here. Esto es como una clue, but it is very important. It is very important. Si algo es muy importante, es como súper necesario. Igual esta. I really need. 
right? I really need. O sea, le está mostrando también que hay una, una necesidad o una urgencia, right? Muy, muy grande. Otra cosa that really called my attention, and, and Edwin was pointing out that, is the number of hours that they got for the activities. Si algo es muy urgente, le damos más tiempo para que termine más luego. Right. Si se fijan, esta tiene bastante tiempo. Pero es ok. Si pusieron esta como uno o como dos. Right. Contact the first three potential customers in the list. Porque ahí tiene tres días, tres horas. Solo son tres potential customers. Pero le va a dedicar tres días, tres horas cada día. So that means. These customers are very important. That you have to convince them, right? It doesn't matter what you do, but I really need that you contact them. So I will put this like number one, right? I really need that you contact them. And that's why, because it's very urgent, I'm giving you nine hours for this. And then, it is very important. So I'm giving four hours for this activity and the date, right? That's something to pay attention to. In las otras dos pueden variar así como que. If you decide to go visit the stores first, or if you want to just send the information. Porque esta de call the clients, you have only two hours for this. Right? But the other one, you have two days and two hours each day. So that means that probably one day you will spend two hours in one store and the other day you will need two more hours for another store, right? Okay, perfect. Now, let's go to your manual. Let's see, I'm going to stop sharing here. Go to your manual. And now we go to this activity that we were working yesterday. Remember? Yesterday, you got the activities or the things that you have to do or that you need to do at work. Se acuerda, page 27. Page 27. Tenemos las actividades, yeah, check, page 27. So what you're going to do right now is to go share your activities with four classmates, okay? So I'm going to send you and I'm going to move you inside the rooms. I'm going to move you so you share your sentences with different people, okay? ¿Se acuerdan de las oraciones que escribieron ayer? Sí. These are about you. What are your activities that you have to do at work? That you have to do or that you need to do? Cuando le diga a su compañero, usted va a tomar nota. Acá. Y aquí va a escribir, por ejemplo... Aquí, aquí está la suya, ¿verdad? Y aquí dice, your partner's list. You will write, for example, Angel has to teach a class at 7 o'clock. ¿Sí? Entonces, si, su, si logra que su compañero le comparta Dos de sus oraciones, esas dos oraciones usted va a escribir aquí. Acá no se preocupe de que tenga solo cinco. Aquí puede tener muchas más, todas las que logre, que le compartan y usted toma nota. Pero, ¿qué sucede acá? Ya no va a decir I have to, ¿verdad? Sino que va a decir... No, no, no se va a ir. 
No quiere mi pencil, su vaya. Ok. Mm -hmm. I want to change it color. Yes. Ok. So you say, Angel has to. Aunque aquí usted, para usted tiene, I have to type a letter early in the morning. Right? Probably, that's your sentence. I have to type a letter early in the morning. Pero cuando vaya a escribir lo que su compañero le está diciendo, Usted va a decir, fulanito has to, porque ella va a escribir lo que su compañero le dice, pero ya lo va, lo va a escribir utilizando la tercera persona. ¿Sí? Si su compañero le dice, por ejemplo, I need to get up very early, usted va a escribir, Walter needs to get up very early. Ok. Acá me va, a, me va a escribir lo que su compañero le dice, pero utilizando la tercera persona. ¿Ok? ¿Está that clear? Yes. 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 Va. Ok, perfecto. Nos vamos. I'm going to send you to the rooms. Okay, there you go. Vamos a ver, Ricardo y, 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 y Maura. Cheque, Maura, si se logra unir al grupo. La voy a mover a otro. ¿Me puede decir una oración mía? I have to work at 7 and 13 a.m. ¿Cómo dijo, Dania? I have to work at 7 a.m. And 13 a.m. Sería, she has to go. Luego. At 7 uh -huh. a.m. Ok. En mi case sería, I have 
to pay the shoes. Ricardo, esa en qué en qué página era esa? En la página número veintisiete. 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 ¿Dónde estaba? Eh, when? The, the time the time, when? Sí, pero es en el siguiente cuadrito. En el siguiente. Sí. I have to... El siguiente cuadro de este que usted estaba viendo del when, what time, where. Oh, ah, yeah. ya. ¿Cuál otro tiene usted? Venia. Eh, Yo otra que tengo. I have to coordinate why community leaders. Sería she has to. She has to coordinate. Wait. Repeat, she has to. She has to coordinate it. Coordinate. Coordinate. White. Yeah. Community leader. Leader. Leaders. Letters. Letters. Okay. La otra mía es I have to. I has to drive. Has to drive. Drive, drive. Right. Okay. Uh -huh. Has to drive. Maura has to take to my. Work. Maura has to say. No. Maura to has to walk. No. Maura has to drive to work. To work. Maura has to drive to work. Okay. Oh, yeah. Y la mía, eh, I have to read the gospel before the first class on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Tranquilo, a mí no me cuesta. Aristides <laughs> has, has to. <laughs> Aristides has to uh -huh. read. Real. Leer. Real. Uh -huh. The gospel. Okay. Gospel. Okay. Sí, ¿Cómo se escucha? El Evangelio, Teresa, el Evangelio. Ah. Ajá, ya cayó. Gospel. 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 Before. Before the oh. first. Before the, the first uh -huh. class. Ajá. Uh -huh. On Tuesdays and. Y, y no hay piscina, sino que solo es la playa. Ya nos ayudó la teacher hablando de. Ah, sí, sí, sí. Ahí escribí, don Walter. Creo que sí. Vaya, ahorita vamos. I have to send the invoice to the client. Se me fue la T. Yeah, uh -huh, to the clients. Sí. Fátima has to, si lo escribimos nosotros, ¿verdad? Teacher has to send the exactly. emails. Exactly. How? Exactly. Fátima has to, has to send the emails. O sea que, o sea que aquí de Don Walter es, eh, 
uh, Walter has, has to, to visit client for afternoon. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He has to visit the, the beaches in the afternoon. Sí. <laughs> really, so, Walter. So okay. Eh, me Search me students for the diver. <laughs> oh, ah, yes, it's true. It's true, it's true. Mm -hmm. Okay. Teacher, okay. usted no quiere ser mi estudiante. I can't <laughs> swim. <laughs> <laughs> First, I have to learn how to swim well, right? If no. Bye bye, teacher. <laughs> no more class, teacher. No more classes. The teacher is in the ocean. <laughs> That's nice. Yes. The, the coral reef, right? Sí. Wow. Um, nosotros no tenemos. Tenemos. Un otro tipo de arrecife. Uh -huh. Solo hay en Roatán, Utila, todo el Atlántico. And here, what, what do you see? What do you see when you enter the, the water? No entendí, teacher, no entendí. ¿Qué ve al fondo? ¿Qué hay? Ah, en el mar, pues obviamente fauna muy variada. Nuestra fauna es muy, muy... Muy abundante. But no arrecife. El arrecife, el arrecife nuestro es un arrecife volcánico. Es acumulación de rocas. Pero es bonito. Es uh -huh. bonito. Are they of different colors? Sí, se ven muy, muy, muy diferentes colores. Sí, de peces especialmente. Mm -hmm. That's y la, 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 los arrecifes que hay en... en el Atlántico son más eh, flora, que es corales Ajá. de cerebro, corales de abanico, uh -huh. pero no hay mucha fauna. Uh -huh. so Así que no tenemos nada aquí en Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay. That's nice. Aquí está escribiendo ya Marlene, escribió otra. Vamos a ver, Marlene has... Marlene has o needs to. Needs to. Marlene need. needs to. Needs to clean your house. Estos muchachos de Luis, Oscar, que ellos los han puesto, pues. Y son bichos, pues, también si puedo. Hello, teacher. Hello, how are you? We have Hello, a tertulia. Hey, you finished. Yes. yes. Okay, I Okay, let's see, 29 seconds. Okay, do I have any volunteers to chair? One volunteer. Yo? Okay. Una, ¿verdad? Sí. Yes. Uh, yes. Um, Isabel has to check um, send emails every day. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you, Teresa. Isabel, tell me. The microphone is around. Aristides has to read the gospel 
before the first class on Tuesday and Thursdays. Okay, great, thank you. Are you still there? Tell me. Uh, Teresa needs to plan the classes for this month. Okay, perfect. Well, for October, right? Uh, no, September. September is gone. <laughs> but she's late. Oh. It should be for October. Takasi. Takasi. One month and you are on vacation. Right? Denia, yes. tell me, Denia. Uh, Mary has to pan the shoes. Mary has to? To pan the shoes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see, Mary, tell me, Mary. Denia, she has to go at 7 a.m. Okay, she has to go to work. Yeah? Si. Work. She has to go to work at 7. Okay, perfect. Let's see, ¿quién más estaba con ustedes? Solo setos. Estaba Ricardo, pero no logró copiar, no logró copiar porque se me desconectó. El... Oh. Pero okay. si compartí con él, con ellas, creo que ya se anotaron las mías. Ah, ok. Vaya, pues lo vamos a perdonar. Edwin, tell me, Edwin. Angel has to send the reports attendance. Ok. Judy has to work all, all weeks. She has to work all weeks. Very good. Eh, uh, Angel. Mm -hmm. has, okay. Has to get gets up 6 30 a.m. Has to get up. En este caso, Edwin, ya al verbo ya no le vamos a poner ese, solo al has. Porque el cambio no. está en has. So Angel has to get up at seven. Correcto. Okay. At seven, Angel. Yes. You have I... to get up at seven? No. 6.30 a.m. At 6.30, okay. Si no sería así como que direct <laughs> to the front of the computer. Okay. Yes. They need to work. Thank you, Edwin. Okay. Angel, tell me. Edwin has to work tomorrow. Okay. And Judy has to come to work at 6 a.m. Okay. Perfect. 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 Just one more sentence, Judy. Okay, tell me present. Angel? Angel present. present. Uh, Aristides? Present. Denia Guadalupe. Present. Eduardo. Edwin. Present. Fatima Xiomara. Present teacher. Isabel. Present teacher. Mauricio. María. Present teacher. Maricela. Marlene. Present teacher. Maura. Present. Nidia. Nidia. Oscar Alejandro. Oscar. Ricardo. Present teacher. Teresa. Present teacher. Walter. Present teacher. Okay. Yesenia. Judy. 
present is share. Okay, perfect. Okay, ¿quién se queda conmigo hoy? Vamos a ver. María. María se quedó. Okay, well, it was a pleasure to be with you today. Have a nice day. Good evening. Good evening. Good night. 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 Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Good night. 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 Bye. Take care. Bye. Bye bye. Okay, hello Marlene. How are you? Hello, hello. Creo que se quedó congelada. Hi Marlene.